return, Robin. All right. Thank you for those comments. Uh, thank you. Thank you all for being here. You know, I obviously haven't done this before, so bear with me. Um, I talked to Stu Morrow, a good friend of mine, that did this last year. And I asked him for advice, and I said, well, how was the press conference? He said, oh, you're going to struggle. And uh, he said, try to tell jokes and stuff. So that's what I'm going to try and do, because uh, this isn't a funeral. Uh, but I did today what I've done for years since that. And I'm, I'm a crier, so expect it. I couldn't get through a Little House on the Prairie episode when I was younger. Um, uh, for years now, game days. I've, uh, I have a routine. The afternoon I get ready, I, I get ready to go. I get in my car, I drive up the rattlesnake up into the wilderness area where the, the where you park your cars, it's, I throw in a, a CD. It's been a different CD every year for lots of years. It's, it's nice stuff, it's mellow stuff, it's serene up there. Uh, I stepped it up a little this year with Adele, but it was, uh, <laughs> Bocelli, I mean, I'm trying to calm, be calm, get ready for the game. Uh, I drive up, I've done it every game. Then I head into the game and I go in and get in my office and do game plan and get, get ready to go. So the whole idea being I'm trying to tell them, relax, it's just a game, and, uh, and you know, don't go crazy. And so you can see how well that worked for me. Um, I've never been able to help it. It's like a cattle prod or something. As soon as the ball goes up, uh, just something I wasn't able to control. Uh, but I did that routine today uh, just for old time's sake. And, uh, you know, I really have no, no chance of thanking uh, all the people that deserve to be thanked. First of all, it's been 38 years. Uh, so many people. Uh, you know, we're talking about basically my program today. But well, I've always thought this, and it's always true, it's 38 years. I mean, something you get to share with others means so much more than something you did by yourself. I really believe that. I mean, it's just twice as rewarding when you can share it. And mine's really special because I, I could share it with thousands, fans, administrators, everybody. That's what has, whatever my success has been, that's, that's who I share it with. That makes it really special. Um, I, know, I know I need to thank, number one, every lady Grizz, Every young woman that ever put on the Lady Grizz jersey and ran out on that floor. <laughs> Told you. For 38 years. And not one game that I don't think they gave me all they had. There's not one game. Didn't always win, didn't always play great, but I won for lack of effort. They were, they were a team. So that's number one, every one of them. And I've heard from a lot of them. Through last night and the day before, and you three showing up made this even tougher. Thanks. No. So I just think that's important because it's, it's uh, when you really think about it, I've never made a basket. Um, it's the teams. It's the players' team. Uh, they control what happens. They, can, they control whether they're going to get along and have fun and bust their butt every day. And I've been blessed because that's what they've done for me. Um, so pretty lucky. Obviously, I don't, haven't had very many assistants. I've had just a few. They all played for me. And we shared Annette for 32 years and Shannon for, I think, 24. And, Trish, who I'll talk about in a minute, for 22 as a coach. Now Sonia. Actually, years ago, before any of you guys were, nobody was watching, I had it. Her name was Kathy O'Brien, was my first assistant. And a gal named Sarah Novak was my second assistant. We, we had a JV team uh, when it was just first start. And kept in contact with uh, Sarah for a few years and 
Kathy, not many of this, that was a long time ago, but I, I did, there was two other assistants in this uh, program. Um, but I owe a lot to my assistants. We share a ton. We work hard together, but we share a ton. I know what I'm going through right now, thinking about my the kids that played for me, having to tell the kids that are playing for me, and uh, it's not easy. But I, I just want to make sure you guys know Trish is going through the same thing.